Friday, Friday Workshop. Workshop. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to Friday Workshop. Yeah, it's Friday Workshop. Friday Workshop for making things money. Thanks to everyone doing the workshop. What are we doing this week? This week we are doing a tool review. Yeah, so uh, Black Friday came and there was an awesome deal on router tables. So we picked up the Rockler router table. So this is the complete uh, Rockler uh, router table package. Uh, it comes with the table, it comes with the fence, um, and the protection kit. This piece right here is the router table package four piece accessory kit. It comes with the feather boards and the dust kit. What do you got over there? Uh, okay, so right here, we got like a thing uh, that will cut out the squares. You know like how sometimes you have uh, ones where you make squares and you make them uh, connect, like with parts, right? This one pretty much just cuts out those squares for you. Yep, that's a box joint jig. Yeah. And so now we can be able to make box joints, which is great because we have a box project coming up. And then we have these router flutes for the box joints. And then we have these setup blocks. These yeah. are um, brass setup blocks, I think. Yeah. Different sizes. <laughs> so, um, yeah, Black Friday was good to us. Yeah. <laughs> so let's move on to the next step. Here we go. All right. Yeah. So this is the Rockler setup. So, um, so this is what's going on. We have these feather boards right here. Um, this feather board and these two feather boards, they're adjustable. Um, there's this um, protection sleeve right here. This whole, um, this whole piece um, slides, this whole fence slides. Um, this is a feather board that can slide when the pieces go this way. And then this piece right here is the box joint. Uh, jig. So is that what holds it into place? So yeah, these all these hold it into place so then it won't go left and right. Oh, let me tighten it just a little bit more. Now, what's now it won't go what's this, Dad, back here? That's uh, for dust collection on the back end there. So these, this is for the box joint jig, which is going to be awesome. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about bummer things about this table, right? Yeah. So uh, first of all, this table is awesome. It's amazing. There's lots of cool things about it, right? What are the bummer things about it, right? So I, I would say, first of all, screwing it to the base, there are no pre-drilled holes. Yeah, not, in, not at all. We have to drill ourselves, in fact. We had to, yeah, we had to drill ourselves. And I ended up having to put tape on my drill here um, because if you don't, you will puncture through the, the top of the table. <laughs> yeah, so, and you'll get a big old hole in your table. Um, that's... That's a bummer. I don't know why they don't pre-drill the holes. Yeah, I don't know either. That's just crazy. And then this is a universal plate right here for routers. Um, and so we have three different routers that we have. We have a uh, we have a um, a Craftsman router. We have a Black and Decker router, and then we have a small um, Makita handheld trim router. None of those three routers would fit on here. Yeah, none the slightest. None of them. Yeah. So. So those are kind of the bummer parts about it. But as far as like the rest of everything goes, this table's amazing. Well, I mean, yes, there's one other thing is the um, the T-bolts um, here. Um, if they just get slightly off, they'll pop through these, these tracks. So they're just a little too small for their use. So I'm probably going to get just bigger T-bolts for that. I think that'll be fine when I get bigger T-bolts for that. They don't have to be any particular size other than they just kind of fit in these grooves here. So, uh, so that that's easily fixable, but the rest of this is definitely um, is definitely stuff we're going to look into. Um, but other than that, so these are my options in order to get this to to work, right? So my my hope is that they have like a universal adapter for um, the routers, so I can screw it in, you know, some sort of plate that I can screw into the router. And then I can screw into the plate here in these three holes, right? So I'm hoping it has both sets of holes. If we don't have something like that, we're going to have to make something like that. Probably out of wood, we're screw into the, the wood from the top of this and screw the wood underneath. And then I screw from the router on the other side, screw into the wood, and then we mount them that way. That's probably what I'm going to have to do, so we'll see that. All right, so if I know Dad, we ain't doing any of that. We're gonna go get a brand new router, and he's been talking about one that he's really wanted for a while. It's called a half-inch collar router, so we're probably gonna go get that, so here we go. 
All right, guys, this is, this is really cool. It went down from, from 189 all the way down to 149 just because Christmas is coming soon. And right here is the router that has, you can see it has two holding things that you can hold it from. And uh, it can use many different bits, a bunch of new ones that we uh, have not been able to use before. And yeah. Yeah, we haven't been able to use the half inch bits before. We've yeah. only been able to do the quarter inch bits, the big bits. <laughs> so I'm really excited to use those new ones. Yeah, cool. So the router is mounted to the bottom, and we are all complete. Yeah. Friday workshop. Friday workshop. Yeah. All right. So this is the Rockler router table. We've got yeah. it all set up. We're going to, going to be doing some cool boxes. Um, future, um, you know, maybe spoiler. Yeah. Um, uh, what's this, Dad? That's the router that we. What uh, kind did we end up in? We got the Bosch router. So really excited about the Bosch router. Um, it's got both quarter and half inch collets. Um, we're going to be able to use the bigger bits in there. Do some really cool stuff. Should be really cool for Friday workshop. Um, so fun stuff. I knew it. I called it earlier. What did you call it earlier? Ah, oh, you'll see when you're editing. All <laughs> right. <laughs> um, well, um, like yeah. and subscribe and turn on bell notifications so you can stay tuned and watch all new videos that we post. And we post a lot. Yeah. So check it out. Yeah. So until next time. See ya. See ya.